All right, Leo. So we got chasing for your first card. We got sleepless nights reverse, and then we got love call messages. So just take what resonates with you, Leo, and leave out the rest. And this energy can be vice versa. So just switch the energy. If it's not you, it's them. You know what I'm saying? So just take what resonates. But Leo, some of you guys, okay, I'm seeing that some of y'all got somebody chasing you in your dreams. And maybe you are having nightmares. Somebody could be having nightmares. Maybe you have to keep waking up at night because there is somebody chasing you in your dream. Um, If they're not actually chasing you, like running chasing you, Leo, some of you guys could just be having somebody pop up in your dreams a lot more. I am getting that energy. And maybe it wakes you up at night. If it doesn't, it could just be the simple fact that you keep having constantly having these dreams of somebody in your dream. And it's because somebody's getting ready to reach out to you, Leo. Because we got love call messages, Leo. Um, yeah. Somebody's getting ready to reach out to you. That's exactly what I'm saying. Especially if you keep having these dreams of somebody coming back. It's because they are. They are. What else do we have? <clears throat> what else do we have? What else do we have? Yeah, somebody definitely is getting ready to come back, Leo. That's exactly what it's saying. We got the Nine of Cups reversed. But whoever this is, Leo, this is somebody that you may not have feelings for anymore. You may not have feelings for this person anymore. Maybe at one point in time you was in a commitment with this person, but it's like maybe they broke it off or whatever. Maybe this is what happened in the past, but... Like I said, whoever it is that's, that's in your dreams, you don't have feelings for them. I really feel like you don't have them anymore like you used to. Some of y'all having these dreams back to back. This is somebody that once held back from you, Leo. From telling you how they really feel about you. Maybe at one point in time in y'all relationship in the past or recently. Maybe you was the one that was chasing them. Maybe you was the one that was pursuing them. But I feel like that inner shit is over. It's like you fell in love with this person, Leo. And I just feel like it's saying that the reason why this person is popping up in your, in your um, dreams, Leo, is because your person still has feelings for you. But they don't want to let you know that. You see what I'm saying? Some of y'all could be a water sign or a fire sign. Yeah, this is somebody that choose to hold back how they really feel instead of coming forward, Leo. But your intuition is on point, especially, Leo, if you already sus like suspect that. Your intuition is telling you that. This person is coming back. Not only are they coming back, but they got secret feelings for you, Leo, and they're getting ready to reach out. Some of y'all got this feeling that this is getting ready to happen, of them getting ready to reach out to you. Did not say that. King of Swords. They're going to let you know, Leo. They're going to let you know how they really feel. Some of y'all could be an air sign, so I'm seeing air, fire, water. Or you could have air, fire, water in your chart. But I am clearly seeing that this person is getting ready to contact you. Some of y'all, this person been hesitant about coming forward towards you actually because they wanted to be sure if they was making the right decision, Leo. They've been going back and forth about it. But they was being pushed by another person to go ahead and reach out to her, you know, or go ahead and reach out to him. You know, somebody else may have told them, listen, it's, just go ahead and retell them how you really feel. That's what I'm seeing. So they've been wishy-washy about it for a minute. Back and forth. Hesitant about it. You see what I'm saying? But they will eventually reach out to you, Leo. Palm tree. This is somebody who... Ha I'm saying like... Your person could be wanting to, I'm here to secure their spot, like, they want to hold on to you, Leo. They definitely want to hold on to you, 
And I feel like a lot of you guys, when this person come back in your life, you have outgrown this person. You have outgrown this person and... Even though they want to tell you how they really feel, they need to know if it's safe to tell you how they really feel. You know what I'm saying? Like, they want to secure their spot. They want to make sure you're not in a relationship. You know, all that before they open up. You see what I'm saying? But I am seeing they will eventually tell you how they really feel. But they just want to know if you already in something else. Or, you know what I'm saying? Because like I said, a lot of you guys, when this person pop back up, you have definitely changed. I need one more spirit. But I am seeing some form of growth on your side. I'll just take both of them. Yeah, this person has to take had to take a look at themselves, Leo. The golden mirror. This person was forced to take a look at themselves. We got kisses, unconditional loving, giving and receiving affection, falling in love. This person, Leo, is in love with you, Leo. We already know that. Because like I said, they may have been holding it back for how they really feel for so long. But they will eventually come forward. But this person, is it, they love you, Leo. But we're going to see. we definitely going to see what's up. Because... People are so freaking unpredictable nowadays. It's like one minute they feel this way, next minute they a whole another way. I don't know. But y'all just use y'all discernment. Like I tell everybody, use y'all discernment. It's because I say what I said in these videos don't mean it have to like the whole thing has to play out this way. You know, it all depends on what you want to do. It could play out this way if you choose to go that route, but it's all about a decision. It takes one decision to make a change. It's all you got to do is make a decision and put it into action. Anything can change. We got patient. Okay, so this this person is willing to be very patient with you, Leo. They want to take things slow. They want to start over. They want to build from the ground up with you, Leo. That's what I'm saying. But like I said, that flower right there, a lot of you guys already passed this person. You have already outgrown this person. You have already leveled up and everything. You have completely changed, Leo. But I am clearly seeing that your person willing to be patient with you. Especially if you already felt you fell in love with them. They willing to be patient with you. Yeah, you really don't miss this person. Discontent and boredom. But for some reason, they kept popping up in your dreams and stuff. You really don't. Some of y'all could be just be like a um maybe you have like a um maybe you have a psychic ability, Leo. And maybe you had like a flash, like what is it called? Maybe you have some type of premonition or some form of um maybe you've seen it before it happened. Is that type of um energy? Because I know I'll be having those psychic abilities where I see things before they happen. But if it wasn't a dream, for an example. But I am seeing that you were not, this is somebody you're not stuck on. This is somebody you don't miss or none of that. That's the energy you're not picking up on. And this person wants to show you some love, Leo. And they're willing to, like I said, wait. They're willing to take things slow with you this time. Because I feel like in the past, this is somebody who was, they was moving too fast. What else, Spirit? It was definitely moving too fast. But this is time. This time, they're willing to be patient with you. They're willing to invest and take their time with you. Then I say that because they actually want you. They actually want to. Some of those person may want to move in with you. But like I said, this person really, really wants to have you, Leo. They see you as their, their other half. They want to commit to you, Leo. They willing to invest into this relationship. I keep getting this. I keep. I got a feeling that all this may not happen right right away, Leo. Some of y'all, this energy could come in within the next nine months to a year. Some of y'all, I'm seeing April 14th. Somebody's birthday could be April 14th. Maybe this person could be an Aries with some of y'all, or you could have Aries in your chart. 
But these numbers stand out so much. I just got the chills. Maybe this person could come around every season of next year. I don't know. Or maybe their birthday could be August 1st or something like that. August 14th. Or maybe this could be your um birthday, Leo. August 4th, August 1st, August 14th. I'm seeing that. I'm seeing somebody's birthday could be August 18th. But... The situation is just out of, out of their control. I feel like a lot of you guys don't want them. We're going to see. Because like I said, you have already let go of how you felt about this person. You know, you have already healed from this person and everything, Leo. And you moved on. You have outgrown this person. You have leveled up. You have changed. You have transformed completely. Some of y'all could be already in another relationship when this person come back. Maybe somebody already invested in you by the time this person come back. And maybe it just be, it may just be too late it just may be too late queen of wands yeah you may not want this person anymore you're holding back your focus is not on them no more you're focused on somebody somebody else or on yourself yeah they may try to force their way back in but i'm hearing a little bit too late buddy that's exactly what i just heard i feel like you're, yeah y'all not y'all don't want to commit to this person y'all do not want to commit to this person whatsoever you don't want nothing to do with this person. It's either that you're not ready for commitment or you don't want this person, Leo. And you feel like this person hasn't changed anyways. Some of y'all feel that way. Yeah, you're moving forward, Leo, to your blessings. I feel like you got a lot of... You not giving this person a commitment will lead to more blessings. I don't know why. Cause I guess Spirit is saying that this person is a snake for real. You know, it's some red flags about this person. It is. Look, did not say that. Holding back. Ace of Wands. You rejecting it. You rejecting this person. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up. Y'all be blessed.